So this week we were studying the types of clouds. And this was a really fun unit to do. We got to go outside and look at the clouds and look at pictures and books and watch our videos. It was just really fun. So at the end of the week, to wrap everything up, I decided to put together this little craft for the kids to make so that they could review the different kinds of clouds that we studied and just kind of give them a hands-on activity to do it. I made this one as I was showing them what they were going to do so that way they could see what they were going to do and then they went ahead and did this one which is the separate individual cards and then I after after it was all done and dried out then I glued them on a piece of ribbon because I had it from last week that I used it for weather fronts and that I'm like well I already have it I don't have to go buy anything I just reuse it so I'll show you what we did for the cumulonimbus clouds and the cumulus and the cirrocumulus, what I did is mixed um, shaving cream, equal parts of shaving cream and glue. So you just mix it all up and then it's really fun. I don't know if you can tell here in the video, but it's puffy and it dries really puffy. And uh, so for the cumulus and the cirrocumulus, just use the plain shaving cream and glue. And then when you're gonna make the cumulonim cumulonimbus, tricky word, um, then I added black paint, a little bit of black paint, and just kind of make it gray to represent that it's going to rain. It's a thunderstorm cloud. For the cirrus, we just did uh, chalk. We just made little lines with the chalk. Stratus, it was uh, cotton. And I just spread it out and just made it thin to represent how the stratus clouds just get uh, covering the sky. And then the stratocumulus, it was the... We use cotton too, but we made the little lines that it makes in the sky when you can see the stratocumulus clouds. So um, I have uploaded this file to the website. You can choose to do the poster like thing like this if you want to just do, do use one sheet and have the kids do it like this. Or um, you can make the cards like this and just, and I'm excited about this because I can hang it up in the school room and just how I decorate the classroom, anything that I can hang up, I'm, I'm glad about. So you have the choice. The file has both, has this one and this one. I hope you guys can use it and have fun with your kiddos. It was really fun to do it.